Step 1. Gather your herbs. Choose high-quality, organic herbs that align with your desired medicinal benefits. Some popular herbs for tinctures include echinacea, ginger, chamomile, and peppermint. You'll need fresh or dried herbs, a glass jar with a tight-fitting lid, and a high-proof alcohol like vodka or brandy. Always opt for organic herbs where possible to ensure the highest quality tincture. Step 2. Prepare your herbs. If fresh, wash thoroughly. If dried, break down into smaller pieces. This step increases the surface area of the herbs, allowing the alcohol to extract more of the beneficial compounds. Step 3. Fill your jar. Add your prepared herbs, leaving enough space for the alcohol. Remember, the herbs need to be fully submerged to create an effective tincture. Step 4. Add your alcohol. Pour slowly, ensuring the herbs are entirely covered. The alcohol extracts the medicinal properties from the herbs, creating your tincture. Step 5. Seal your jar tightly. This prevents any alcohol from evaporating and stops external elements from contaminating your tincture. Step 6. Label your jar. Include the name of the herb, the type of alcohol used, and the date. This is particularly useful if you're making multiple tinctures at once. Step 7. Store your jar in a cool, dark place. This slows down the extraction process, allowing the tincture to develop over time. Step 8. Shake your tincture daily. This helps to mix the alcohol and herbs thoroughly, ensuring a potent tincture. Step 9. Wait for extraction. This process usually takes about 2 to 6 weeks. Patience is key here, the longer it sits, the stronger it gets. Step 10. Strain your tincture. Use a cheesecloth or fine mesh strainer to separate the liquid from the herb matter. Step 11. Bottle your tincture. Use a dark glass bottle with a dropper for easy application. Step 12. Label your bottle. Again, include the herb name, alcohol type, and the date. Step 13. Store your tincture. A cool, dark place is ideal. Properly stored, a tincture can last for several years. Step 14. Use your tincture. The recommended dosage is typically a few drops under the tongue or in a glass of water. However, always consult with a healthcare professional before using any new herbal product. Step 15. Experiment with combinations. As your tincture-making skills advance, try using multiple herbs in one tincture for a more complex blend. Step 16. Grow your own herbs. For truly personalized tinctures, consider growing your own herbs. This allows for complete control over the quality and variety of your ingredients. Step 17. Share your tincture. Herbal tinctures make wonderful, personalized gifts for friends and family. Step 18. Continue learning. The world of herbal tinctures is vast and fascinating. Keep exploring, trying new herbs and combinations, and refining your techniques. Thank you for joining us in the Herbal Tincture Masterclass. Use this knowledge to unlock the benefits of nature, right from your own kitchen. Happy tincturing!